Yo guys, welcome back to The Walking Dead, a new frontier. In today's episode, we are playing episode 2, Ties Not Mine, part 2. In the wake of a sudden trouble, Javier leads a group of refugees towards the safety of a nearby town. Start episode 2. This game series adapts to choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Please, let me do the dishes. That's the least I can do. I'm crashing here. Crashers clean dishes. Your family. Besides, if they're not clean the right way, David becomes a big baby about it all. Ooh. I'm make, a pro at this point. Make David do it. Well, then tell the big baby to get in here and wash them himself. It's not a big deal. No, nah, I know you don't mind, but... I, I won't be here for too long. Just, you know, gotta get back on my feet a little. You're right. I don't mind. But David does. Is that it? Maybe a little bit. No, actually, forget I said that. Uh, that wasn't for me to... Just forget it. Sorry. <sighs> well, he can just deal with it. He's always giving me shit for not being around anyway. Your family. That means the door's always open. So where do you think you'll go? Don't know. With what happened, I'd be amazed if I could get a job assistant coaching T-ball. You'll land on your feet. Oh, well, here's open. I could use a fresh start. Uh, I'll, I'll probably just travel around, you know, see what's out there. Want to take me with you? Well? Uh, sure. Uh, Sure. Just finish up with those dishes and I'll bring the car around. <laughs> but I pick the music. <laughs> yeah, never mind then. You know I'm just messing around, but it's hard to say no to a fresh start. I always wanted to go to Norway, see the northern lights. But you'll be jet setting and I'll still just be here. Oh, oh god damn it. Oh Ooh, shit. Quick, shit, run underwater. Shit. That was David's army glass. Oh, he's gonna be so pissy about it. I can hear him already. Oh, it's so annoying. Just blame me. What, he'll buy it. I'm the idiot fuck-up, right? That's true. Exactly. Fuck who? <sighs> there you, you have go. to agree with that shit. See? Much better. What was that noise? Guys! Hello? My CEO gave me that. And unless you want to dig up his fucking corpse, he's not going to give me another well, why one. Why don't we get an actual dishwasher? Oh, here we go again. Then you won't be on my ass anytime there's a spot on a fork. Excuse me? If we could even afford a dishwasher. David, come on, take it easy. It was an accident. Stay out of this hobby. Not until you step away and cool off. We don't see your ass for a year. A year. <sighs> then when your life goes to shit, we're expected to drop everything and roll out the red carpet. All for Prince Javi. And now you're gonna start telling me how to talk to my wife? This isn't about him. Really? He's the one standing right there judging me for something he doesn't understand. You don't know him like I do. You know what, David? Time for you to open your eyes. Kate's gonna leave your ass. What? She told Honey! me so. You said that? Jesus fucking Christ, no! We were talking about traveling and I just... No, I definitely didn't say that. At all. Three days. Then I want you off my couch and out the door. We clear? Fine. Javi, that is my husband. We are married. In case you forgot. That's for life. Not really, but you know, gonna have to be for life. Doesn't have to be. <coughs> Boom. 
Hey, hey, take it easy. Hey, hey! What happened? They got away. Oh, God. Mariana. I already dug a grave for her. Thank you. You deserve so much better than this. Fuck, it wasn't supposed to go like this. Javi, thank you for staying. I think you probably saved my life. I couldn't leave you alone. That's because you're a good man. Well, not good enough to save her. You bought your people time, though. That counts for something. Hey, hang on a sec. She carried this around for years. I'm sorry I never found you those candy bars. Didn't you have a candy bar though? You deserved just so much more life. You should have been the one burying me. Except someday. Someday far away. Look at his shadow, doesn't have hair. You did everything you possibly... It's just a walker, or a muerto. The other guys had this too. Oh, shit. What? Well, what's wrong? Clem? I've run into these guys before. Who are they? Please? They call themselves the New Frontier. They used to be decent people. Now they're something else. This brand they have. It's like an initiation thing. I was kind of stuck in their camp for a while. Not by choice. It was bad. I'm lucky to be alive. What do you mean, stuck? Were you a prisoner? I got out. That's all that matters. They left one of their cars behind. 
That's something at least. Good. Just like you always wanted. I can take you back to Prescott, make sure your family's okay. But then I'm hitting the road. Suit yourself. Good luck out there, Clem. Thanks, Javi. We should get back to Prescott. You're back. How's Kate? Uh, she... Just came out of surgery. Eleanor's still with her. You'd best get over to the infirmary. You made it back. She asked for you. You know. I got here as soon as I could. Those guys didn't go down without a fight. And then... Mariana. I managed to stabilize her. Those bastards did her one favor, at least. Any lower, and that bullet would have torn her stomach lining as well. Your boy Gabe. He seems really fierce. He wanted to help so badly. He practically forced me to let him stay. That's Gabe. But she was bleeding so much, he... got overwhelmed. So when's she gonna be up on her feet again? She's stable. For now. But... she's still bleeding inside. I don't wanna lie to you. It's probably just a matter of time. I... No. I don't accept that. I can't. I've done everything I can for now. I'm sorry, Javi. I'm going to get cleaned up. You may want to find Gabe. He looked pretty upset when he left. This isn't going to make him feel any better. Still. I'll track him down. Flew in a plane just like this to a baseball game in Arkansas once. Lifetime ago. I'm copying me a water bottle. Mind now, bitch. <laughs> How's she doing? Not great. As well as can be expected. Yeah, considering. You should have come back with us. Your family, they needed you. Clementine needed my help back there. She could take care of herself. Your family, they were the ones who needed help. It's a hell of a situation. Just know I'm praying for you. All of you. And whatever happens, you all are welcome to stick around in Prescott, if that's what you want. Nobody's gonna force you, but we'd be glad to have you all here. Not gonna make a decision like that without talking to Kate, so... I'd rather check in with her when she's feeling better, you know? Sure thing. Let the lady weigh in first. I know Trip drove like hell to get Kate back here. Hey, 
Have you seen a kid come through here? Blood all over his hands. Dark look on his face. Headed off that way, without saying a word. If I were you, I'd give him some space. Just my advice, one parent to another. Yeah, well, I don't need your advice. Just trying to help. Honest. That blood, I take it that wasn't his? His stepmom's. You gotta stay strong for her. Do whatever it takes. Know if my friend seen one in the same situation, I'd fight like hell. Anything we can do to help you out, just let me know. I, uh, appreciate that. Your boy stomped off towards the front gate. Hmm. Doesn't look super sturdy. go back and bury Mariana. We buried her. It was peaceful. How could it have been peaceful? I know how much you miss her, Gabe. I miss her too. And Kate, she needed me during her surgery. She needed my help. I just ran away like a stupid little kid. You're right. You should have stayed. Kate needed you back there. I needed you back there. I know, I just... I just lost it. That's not an excuse. Not anymore. I'm done feeling this way. Feeling powerless. I can't be some helpless little boy anymore. I need to be a man. Just like my dad was. He knew how men were supposed to act. What you said sounds real nice. But easier said than done. I don't care if it's not easy. Next time, I'm not gonna sit back and watch. I'm gonna do something. I have to. Listen, Gabe. Shit. Get inside! Now! We might have to leave. Make sure Kate's ready. You can count on me. I thought you kicked her ass out. Knock, knock! Anyone home? He was one of the men at the junkyard. These are those freaks that brand themselves. I wish we hadn't had to come all the way out here, but unfortunately, Badger here says you attacked his man. He says you fired on him. They shot first. They killed my niece. Shot a woman in cold blood. How many of my friends died because of you, huh? Sounds like a bunch of he said, she said shit to me. Well, what the fuck do you want? An apology? What I really want is for my dead buddies to be alive again. But I don't think that's too likely, is it? He needs to come with us. Answer to justice. Accept his punishment. Men have got to have laws. Otherwise, we're no better than the animals. Go fuck yourselves. You're not getting shit from us. That gate ain't bulletproof. Don't make me prove it. Fact of the matter is, you stole from us. You killed some of us. Give it up now and get down here. I feel like we all just started shooting. I know we kill I think them. they need a little incentive. Screw him, kill that faggot. Free! 
Francine! <laughs> you hurt her, I'll kill you! Whoa! You didn't tell me you had a hostage. It's gonna be okay, baby. I love you, I'm baby. All right, baby. Just... Just give them what they want. There's no reason this has to get ugly. She's innocent in this. You don't have to drag her into our fight. I don't have to. But I kind of want to. Oh my god! Get your ass down oh here! Or I cut off the rest of them. What the hell are you doing? Hobby, please. Man. That was fucked just, up. Just go with him. You got to. You kill Francine. Nobody's giving in to them. We should start shooting. No fucking way. He'll kill Francine. He might kill her anyway, Conrad. We gotta risk it. No. Uh-uh. No way. We do not open fire while she's down there. Look. I'm sure we can work this out without anyone else getting hurt. Not interested in you trying to fucking stall. I'm gonna count from five. You know what happens at zero. Five. Four. Three. Sorry, Francine. But she's reloading. Oh, baby. Rest in peace, gate. Oh, what the fuck? We don't have the go ahead. No, fuck you. Fuck the go ahead. Ram the fucking gate. Christ. Shoot their fucking driver. Press the wrong goddamn button. Or key, I guess. Fuck you, Zambi. <laughs> Fucking tear gas! <laughs> I have to find Kane Gabe. Can you help us? <laughs> Go, man. I'll hold these assholes off. <laughs> Stab. Don't forget the knife. Take that shit. Bobby! Gabe! <laughs> Bless the motherfucker! He's just what one popping say? everybody he sees. <laughs> Drive! Head east. We'll catch up. That was a really good start to the chapter.
Some savage motherfuckers. That was, uh, that was a really good start to the chapter, though. I appreciate that. Whoa, what is these frames? Are they following us? Not just the other car. Looks like we're okay. Eleanor, thank God. I can't believe it. All of our friends, all those people. Oh, Conrad. I'm sorry, Conrad. You're sorry? You're sorry? You're the one who opened fire. She's dead because of you. Conrad? Easy, buddy. This wasn't his fault. Bullshit. Francine, Prescott, all because this washed up cheat walked through our gates. I should have known it the second I looked at you. We. We just lost someone, too. So. Say what you have to say. What? That's supposed to make me feel better? Calm down, Conrad. Please. All I know is if it wasn't for him. Back the fuck off, now! Just back away! Take it easy, son. Gabe, you know guns are a last resort. What else am I supposed to do? He was threatening you. Just do it already. I don't even care anymore. Just put it down, Gabe. Well, what are you waiting for? Don't touch my uncle again. Fuck me. Gabe! Let him go. He just needs to cool off. What the hell was that? <laughs> Word psychology or something? Something like that. I wanted him to shoot him, to be honest. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Stop being a pussy. <laughs> Shut up. We have to go back. We have to bury her. I wish we could, but Prescott's overrun. We can't go back. Well, we're not safe here either. What probably a zombie you? right now. I've heard Walker. there's a community there. Sorry. If it's true, they'll have food, walls, maybe even a hospital. All I want is to find the motherfuckers who did this. They took my home. They took my... God damn it! You want revenge? You're gonna need help. Maybe going to Richmond is the way to get it. Richmond? Huh. It's something, at least. <sighs> yeah. Fuck it. Let's go. That's a spirit, man. Hey, dude. Oh. Hey. You okay? Huh. Maybe they'll hit it off. Yeah. Hope so. Might be good for them both. They need someone their own age they can talk to. Come on, guys. We got a long drive ahead of us. All right. Maybe we should try to, you know, get some decent firearms on ourselves. You know, get, get ready. Just in case. You know, assuming we have to kill a bunch of fuckers. This is what I would have done in that situation. Um, fuck Francine. I feel like I'm burning up. <laughs> Shot her myself. Like, that's how much I give a shit. Then they'll be like, whoa. Okay, boss, we'll leave. But then you don't let them leave. You gun them all down. Here you go. Shot their tires out, too. She just had someone leave, flank out, shoot the tires, There's and then once the tires out. start getting shot out, boom, 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 boom. Start taking everybody out. Uh, hot. Hot. Fuck. It's probably sepsis. Sooner we get to Richmond, the better. <sighs> oh, God damn it. Well, it really hurts. 
Oh, I never knew you were the self-pitying type. <laughs> I'm like, fuck you, bitch. When you get shot in the spleen, I think they give you a self-pity pass. They don't. <laughs> he punches her in the spleen. No, Javi. That would be fucking hilarious. We both know what's coming. I'm not excited you yet. We do. And this is gonna sound fucked up, but maybe this is my chance for... Christ. I don't know. A graceful exit. Not many people get those. You don't get to just bow out. I do. <laughs> just think about all that's happened. Mariana died and I couldn't stop it. And Gabe, I heard what happened when we stopped. Isn't it obvious? Gabe's a psychopath? Yeah. Look, he might be turning into David. He might be turning into you. He's not that sweet little boy I first met. He needs to be tough. Tougher than David ever was. That's how he'll survive. It's what this world demands. Maybe I just don't understand this world anymore. All I care about is got becoming goosebumps. who it needs to be. Oh, it's right there. And it's gonna be on you to make sure that happens. You know I'll be there for him. For as long as he wants me to be. I do know. But it's still nice to hear. Oh! Hey, careful. Sorry. You should get some rest. <laughs> She's the doctor, too. Yes. You think she would have been careful yeah. in the first place? With pleasure. She's a pothole. <laughs> that hurt, bitch. Pretending the rest of us can't hear. I wouldn't know. Look at their top speed right there. That thing's going like two miles an hour. Holy fuck. That was fast. On the road again. <laughs> that was actually fucking hilarious. She just keeps going and runs him over. <laughs> Great. What now? I've got some bad news. We don't have time for more bullshit. Well, the bullshit found us anyway. Well, we got a bunch of cars clogging the underpass. Too many to drive through. We're gonna need to move some of them out of the way. <sighs> hey, I'm coming too. I'll stay with Kate and keep a lookout. Yell at us if anything happens. Awfully convenient the pass is blocked like this. Not convenient at all, if you ask me. <laughs> if we move that car right there, we should be good. Come on, let's get to work and clear it out. How are we doing? Eh, Conrad doesn't look too good over there. Tell me about it. He's a good man, Javi. <laughs> Known him a long time. This is just a dark day for him. Yeah. Keep an eye on him for me, all right? What do I have to keep an eye on? I ain't fucking doing anything, cunt. We 
need to power it somehow. There's gotta be a way to power this thing. I'll look around. Now I can pull out the cable. Hopefully that'll hold. Still need something to power this puppy. Just dumbass dying like out of the way, I guess. You good? Nah, man. I'm not good. I know. Let's just get this shit over with and get to Richmond. Chances of that. <laughs> Saw you and Clementine talking back there. So? We were just talking. She seems pretty cool. Uh huh. You're not gonna smash? What's up? It's complicated. Usually, it's just me on my own. Having people is nice. But it always ends up hurting in the end. Never think otherwise. You probably use these jumper cables on the van. Pop the hood. You'd better not mess up my baby here. That'll do. Here goes nothing. Hey! There we go! I think we're set. We good? Be ready to move once the wreck is clear. We should be right behind you. Will do. Get the walkers! Tommy! Maybe not sure what type of fucking zombie. Eleanor, now! Go, go, go! Just drive! Get it to Richmond! We're right behind you! They're through! Let's go! Thanks. Shit! The van! We got bigger problems here! The roof! Go! Get a lot of zombies. Would be a shame if we had some fun. Come on, Javier! Get up there, Gabe! Go! How about you just go and not fucking go for ladder? Oh!
We just start going do 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 do. Start laying those fuckers out. God damn it! I knew this place didn't feel right. What the hell are we gonna do now? We have to come up with some kind of plan. We don't have a choice. We gotta fight our way out. Not so I like our odds. Great. This is just fucking great. What the hell are we gonna do? Calm down. <sighs> calm down? I'm not gonna fucking calm down. Eleanor's out there alone right now. We wouldn't even be in this mess if it wasn't for you. That's not true. <sighs> Fuck you, Conrad. Whoa, 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 stop. There's somebody over there. What? Where? Shit. I see Everybody get down. Wait, was this all a trap? <sighs> Keep your heads down. Guy could have a rifle. Whoever you are, you should know we've got guns. And we're prepared to use him. What the hell? He's gone. Everyone stay here and keep behind cover. I'm gonna see what I can find out. Be careful. His tires. I'm gonna need you to turn around for me. Slowly. Did you hear me? The hell? That thing's not a toy. Drop it, or you might hurt yourself. Now then, I'm not gonna shoot. Not unless you make me. I just wanna talk. You got me? Just wanna have a word. Put the gun down. That wouldn't be very smart of me, would it? You, the two guys there, the kids, the women in the car, I saw you split up. I overheard that little argument just now. Your friends over there aren't gonna shoot me, right? You folks have your shit together? You want to know whether they'll shoot you? Keep pointing that gun at me. Couple more questions. Then we're done. You're going to Richmond. That tells me you got something to do with what's going on down there. Question is, whose side are you on? Look, man. I don't know what you're... <laughs> shit. Don't move. Well, you see one of them? Hey, man, what do you mean by them? Who's them? You know what I'm talking about. <clears throat> the New Frontier. What? No, I'm not with those guys. You got this backwards. Avi? This guy's full of donkey shit. I don't think he's with those guys. Look, I'm telling you. I'm on my way to Richmond, just like you. I lost touch with some good people there when the New Frontier took over. What did you say? The New Frontier? They took over Richmond? Don't tell me you didn't know that. Fuck. Oh, God. Eleanor and Kate. They're headed right to the middle of those assholes. At least now we got an excuse to go after those motherfuckers. What are we gonna do? We need to go. Now. No fucking shit we need to go. Well, go then, bitch! Oh, Fuck! You got any ideas? There's an old train tunnel that runs under the James River. 
From what I hear, it should be a straight shot into Richmond. A train tunnel. I could lead you guys there. And, uh, I know you're all having trust issues today, but maybe you could lower those guns first. Lower than my ass? We're gonna tie you up and make sure your story checks out. That's really not necessary. I lower trust your guns. This is Jesus, I, I already know. Man, don't. Do you trust me or not? No. <laughs> Thank you. Snaps Ready? my fucking neck. This way. Hey. What do we call you? Like he's a fucking Sorry, animal. I forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. Oh, I don't care. Comes another Clemmy Clem flashback. Because I gotta feel like fucking 10 minutes of story. God forbid it not be an hour long. It just went out of focus, too. We can hide in here. Okay. How does it show perfectly? You just broke it. Oh, come on. It didn't make any sense. <laughs> Shut up! You're hungry. Sorry. Your baby fucking sucks, Glenn. We're gonna wait for them to go, and then we're gonna find you some dinner. Hopefully, find us some dinner. Hey, I can hear you in there. Let me in, please. God, there's so many. Oh, shit. Hey there. Hello. You can keep that thing pointed at me if it makes you feel better, but if you shoot me, you'll have to deal with all of them. True. Pretty big group of them out there. But it'll pass. Eventually. Leave! You can't stay here! Sorry, kiddo. Think you're stuck with me. <laughs> Shit! I'd say we make a pretty good team. The two of us. Well, the three of us, I mean. Thanks, I guess. No problem, kiddo. Anytime you need an oversized doorstop, you know who to call. He's a cute kid. You guys living here? You seem kind of young to be a mom. What are you? Thirteen? His real parents are gone. I'm all he has. Then he's cute and lucky. He has someone looking after him. Not much of that anymore. We were out there scouting. Nothing out of the ordinary, and then... Ordinary, and then... Chaos, and... Shit. Those bastards are slow, but God damn it, when there's enough of them. I got separated from the others. God. I hope they all made it. Thought we were ready for anything. What were you scouting for? Gas? Water? Any supplies we could find, really. Sure as hell wasn't worth it. My people are probably at the rendezvous by now. What's left of them, at least. By the way, I'm Ava. And my group? We call ourselves the New Frontier. 
He's hungry. Hey, why don't you come with me? Meet my people. We have food, blankets, bottled water. Come on, dinner's on me. That sounds good. Sounds great, actually. Once the herd is gone, my people will find us. Okay. Let's get this over with. I want to do the Javier stuff. That's what I paid the twenty-five fucking dollars for. These tunnels hobby. were abandoned decades ago, but I've heard you can get through. Here's hoping. Javi, I need to talk to you. About? Look, I appreciate you keeping quiet about me in the New Frontier. But what I told you earlier, it's not the whole truth. I wasn't their prisoner. I was... I was one of them. I should have told you sooner. I... I really should have. Oh my god! You let them brand you? That was a really late reaction. Oh my god! I'm not asking you to forgive me. <laughs> but you have to understand. I had nobody. And they had food, supplies. I was all alone, Javi. You don't know what that's like. It was a mistake. Tell me you're not still one of them. No way. Believe me. I just had to explain, because if they're really in control in Richmond, I can't let them see me. I just can't. So when we reach the other side of this tunnel, I'm leaving. Y'all planning on joining us? Shh. You all hear that? Coming from over there. Can you see anything? <laughs> They're everywhere! Fuck! They are. Keep sharp. Watch out! <laughs> Conrad, now every walker in the fucking county is gonna be heading this way. Come on, follow me. Why would you start shooting bullets? Oh shit, let's press the wrong key. Uh, what the fuck? No one ever mentioned a train in the way. We better find a way around it, or we're fucking dead. Maybe we can just go through. Well, does it open? I got it. It opens. Daylight's ahead. Thank fucking God. Let's go. We can't have those walkers following us. Javi and I will block the door. You guys go ahead and make sure it's clear. Make it fast. We'll be right ahead of you. I'm staying here. Hold the door shut until I can find something to barricade it with. Hurry! Found something. We rip off a fucking shit. I'm gonna have to break this thing off. Hurry! They're almost here. <laughs> Javi! <laughs> There's too many! Help! Yeah, bitch! <laughs> now. Oh shit! There we go. Okay, let's go. We gotta. I wouldn't touch that gun, girl. You either, cowboy. What the hell are you doing? I heard you too. You think I'm stupid? Finish your little story. Now. We we need to keep moving. Nope. You need to talk. Put the gun down, Conrad. Not until she rolls up her sleeve. <laughs> what? Why?
I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. What other bullshit did you shove down our throats, huh? Jesus. Conrad, lower the fucking gun. This isn't necessary. Lower it? You're missing the bigger picture, son. Don't you see? We bring her to Richmond. They'll give us whatever we want. Medical help for Kate. She's our bargaining chip. They won't bargain with you. You don't know them. Won't know until we try. She's not a bargaining chip. She's a friend. How's that for an answer? Go to hell, Conrad. Fuck you, Conrad. You're not doing this. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? Then don't let her walk through that door. Crazy. Shoot Nobody him. has to shoot anybody. Just tell Clem this is how it's gotta be. And then we all step into the sunshine. Come on, man. Be reasonable. This helps both. Bye, Conrad. Holy shit. Stupid oh my, bitch. Oh my god. <laughs> something, about, something about saying stupid you bitch is just fucking go. satisfying and hilarious. You? I'll find my own way. Don't break your little Gabe's heart. He's not even nutted yet. Well, he's long as... dead. Damn right he is. Take his fucking... God. Take his piece. It just happened so fast. Gabe, shut the fuck up and take his piece. We're moving on, Gabriel. Now. Let's go. Look at that zombie in the background. <laughs> fucking twitching. Where's Conrad? We shot him. Shot him in his fucking dumb head. Where's Conrad? Did he not make it out? He's... He's gone. He didn't make it out. I'm sorry. So that's it? He just... Oh, man. Conrad! <sighs> Shit! Fuck! Try to stay quiet. <sighs> Shit. Jesus fucking Christ. Damn it, Conrad. And the girl, where is she? Or should we assume the worst? She ran off. I just don't know what the hell is going on anymore. God, what a shit show. This isn't what any of us wanted. But right now, we need to find Kate and Eleanor. You're right. I just wish... The gates are this way. If your people are here, that's where they would have ended up. Why is it so quiet? Thought there'd be New Frontier marching in the streets and shit. Practicing on walkers or... Whatever the fuck they do. Don't get too cocky. They could be watching. Roger that. see us? I don't think so. Can you see anything, Javi? What are they doing? That's their car! Hey, keep it down. Kate? Kate, can you hear me? Kate, talk to me. Say something. Javi? Yes. Could really use something to take the edge off right about now. Huh. Very funny. I've been saving it for a while. Kate! Are you. Are you okay? Come here. Where's Eleanor? She. She went ahead to get help. She hasn't come back. Damn it. They must have got her. Jesus, how far is it to their compound? Not too much farther now. A couple blocks at most. Gabe, help me lift her up. <laughs> I'm 
I'm thinking Kate's not gonna make it much longer. So it's time we walk up to their front door and say hello. Say hello! <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> there it is, New Richmond. We're here, Kate. I'm going to get you inside, okay? Avi, if they can save me, how about you and me finally take that trip to Norway? The Northern Lights. Remember? Fuck as long yeah. as we make some time to hit the slopes, I'm in. Jesus, there's a solid possibility this isn't gonna go our way. If you want to stay behind, I wouldn't blame you. Hey, this is where I was going in the first place. Hey! You again? You must have some kind of death wish. She needs medical help. And you have one of our people. Uh-huh. What's your point? After what you did to our people? Just open the gates, damn it. She needs to get to the hospital or she's gonna die. Sorry, but these gates are staying closed. It was your men that shot her. Your bullets. You owe it to us to help now. We don't owe you shit. It's got nothing to do with me. That girl your people shot? That was her daughter. And the other one, Gabe? He's right here beside me watching her die. You can stop this if you want to. Please, Kate's dying. She needs help. It's not like I don't have a heart, okay? But your people started this whole fucking thing in the first place. Let's not forget what you did at Prescott. What you did to our home. Prescott, right. That whole situation was a damn mess. Uh. It happened. It's over. Not that I can do about it now. Please, I am begging you, just let us in. Now all of you, lower your weapons. Might be a good idea to play along here, at least for now. You put him down, I'll see that as an expression of good faith. Nice and easy. Everybody, put him down. Trip, please. You're the boss. Yeah, okay. Hands behind your heads, all of you. We let him do this, it's over. We can't give him another inch. No. Guess we're doing this the hard way, then. What the hell's going on out here? They said they weren't here to hurt anybody, so I was trying to see if they... Oh, my God. Dad? Uh, yeah. All right, how did you deal with David and Kate's argument? How did Prescott handle an infantry Prescott? You and 58.6% opened fire. Did you trust Jesus? You and 86.2% of players took him on his word. How did, how did you deal with Conrad's threat to call him a dying? Killed Conrad. How far did you get? How far did you go to get into Richmond? You and ninety five point nine percent of players capitalize on to Max's demands. So I did actually better this time. I did the majority of what people did, which is technically, I guess, the good answers. I don't know. Hey, continue. Let's get out of this. All right, guys. That was the end of episode two. And next episode, we'll be playing. Episode 3 above the law, shocking the women's driver which between brother, little brothers and arms. So we will do that next episode. So if you guys enjoyed your like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.